And now on Night Beat, just hours ago, a bomb squad set off a loud explosion that rocked the San Jose neighborhood for a second time tonight. The first loud explosion sent two men to the hospital and evacuated neighbors from their homes for most of the evening. This all happened just after 3 o'clock at Moonflower Cords. Night Beat's Joe Vasquez is live at the scene with the latest for us. Joe. Julia, we still have an active crime scene, and behind me, you can see that second house back there has a white trailer in front of it. Well, right behind the trailer, inside the garage, police say two men were handling fireworks that suddenly blew up. Sound like a bomb. As the San Jose Police Bomb Squad Unit investigates the aftermath of an explosion inside a garage on Moonflower Court. It was like a bang. It was a big bang. Neighbors have been kept out of their homes behind police lines for most of the evening. We have probably about 10 to 15 houses that are uh, evacuated right now. It was like a boom, and then like the house kind of rumbled. Taylor Poppin was inside the house when she heard the explosion just after 3 o'clock in the afternoon. She ran to the garage to find her boyfriend, 30 year old Rogelio Romayor, writhing in pain. He's now at Santa Clara Valley Medical Center with severe wounds. His fingertips and a few burns on his chest. His fingertips were blown off. Oh, kind of. Just the, the two tips of them, though. I know it could have been a lot worse, though. She says the other man, a 25 year old neighbor, was not as badly injured. Late this evening, another loud explosion rattled the evergreen neighborhood. <laughs> After the bomb squad unit decided to detonate other fireworks, they also recovered inside the garage. Police still have Moonflower Court backed off, that is, blocked off. But they have allowed neighbors back inside their homes. Reporting live on the Night Beat, I'm Joe Vasquez. All right, thank you, Joe.